Good afternoon, this is Michaela Tennyson with Grain Commentary for the Market Week ending October 9th. All three markets closed higher this week with corn futures finishing up 16 cents, soybean futures finishing up 46 cents, and wheat futures finishing up 25 cents. The USDA Crop Progress Report had corn harvest at 25% complete compared to 14% last year. Corn traded higher from the 336 million bushels that were cut from ending stocks for 2021 and trimmed the acres by 1 million. Also, corn borrowed strength from the rally in the soybean market. Weekly export sales this week came in at 48 million bushels, which is about double the pace that is needed each week. Soybeans closed higher this week, and the USDA Crop Progress Report had soybean harvest at 38% complete compared to 12% last year. The weather has been favorable for harvest, and harvest keeps moving along. We hit new contract highs this week as Brazil remains dry, delaying planting and delaying their export window. The WASDE report was bullish and lowered planted acreage by 700,000 acres, lowered harvested acreage by 700,000 acres, and left yield unchanged at 51.9 bushel per acre. The report also lowered carryout by 170 million bushels to 290 million bushels. This is the tightest U.S. carryout since 2015 and 16. Weekly export sales this week came in at 95 million bushels compared to the 14 million bushel pace that is needed each week. <clears throat> The crop progress report had winter wheat planting at 52% planted compared to 48% last year. The USDA lowered the carryout for wheat to 883 million bushels, which was expected. Wheat found strength from dryness in Russia and was also helped by the strength in the corn and soybean markets this week. Weekly export sales for wheat came in at 19.5 million bushels, which is also ahead of the needed pace that is needed each week. Be sure to watch the market for any selling opportunities that may come up and contact your local Country Visions grain merchandiser. Thank you for listening to this week's market update and have a great weekend.